a lot of my patients, especially seniors who are encouraged to go out of their house to mingle would avoid doing so because they said they easily feel dizzy. Whatever the cause of dizziness, either because of motion sickness, vertigo, or an upset stomach, you would be unable to focus because of the bothersome feeling. In fact, most of the time, you'd feel so helpless and bad that your only option would be to reach out to another pill, which will solve the problem for you. There are lots of over-the-counter medications to treat nausea, but why does it have side effects? That is because most anti-nausea medications available act directly in your nervous system. Is there any other option? Is there a natural remedy to help prevent nausea and vertigo without the side effects? In this video, I will teach you the best anti-nausea remedy that always works every time without the undesirable side effects. Stay with me until the end so you will know how to correctly prepare it for yourself. Hi, this is again Dr. Cherry, Doctor of Physical Therapy, teaching you health tips and home exercise programs that you and your family can benefit from. All anti-nausea ingredients in over-the-counter medications currently approved by FDA act on the nervous system. And in an attempt to help alleviate the dizziness, one can experience side effects including drowsiness, fatigue, blurring of vision, and tinnitus or ringing in the ears. Plus, anti-nausea drugs are not to be used if you have asthma or other conditions in the lungs nor should it be combined with alcohol for a possible interaction. So what is an effective and natural option? A natural home remedy for vertigo and dizziness that works every time without any undesirable side effects is ginger. In fact, since it is effective and it does not cause any side effects, it is used in China and India to relieve nausea and indigestion. In Germany, ginger is an approved ingredient for anti-motion sickness and in Denmark, ginger is endorsed by their government as a treatment for travel sickness and rheumatism. And this humble spice is an over-the-counter anti-nausea remedy in the United Kingdom. There are two compounds found in ginger. Shuggles and gingerols, which gives it its anti dizziness and anti vertigo effect. Gingerols in ginger is renowned for its contribution in human health and nutrition, and medicinal properties of ginger had been found to alleviate nausea, arthritis, and pain. Both of these compounds boost a host of biological activities ranging from anti cancer antioxidant, antimicrobial, and anti-inflammatory. Ginger for vertigo and dizziness had been found to suppress vomiting by as much as 72%, and it can protect you against motion sickness for as much as 4 hours. Not only that, ginger had been found effective to prevent nausea after a surgical operation and even after a chemotherapy session. If you're wondering if it's safe, Ginger had been used as a food and medicine for centuries now without any reported side effects. But ginger can actually act as an anticoagulant, meaning it can thin out your blood. So people who have bleeding disorders or who are in anticoagulants should prevent consuming large amounts of ginger. To prevent dizziness and vertigo without any side effects, use ginger, fresh ginger root and powdered form had been found to be effective. But if you have fresh ginger root, then that is more advisable because it has greater content of ginger rolls in it compared to the powdered form. 
to prepare, clean and wash a medium-sized ginger root and then slice it with the peel on because the peel has the greatest amount of ginger oils. Let it boil in two cups of water and let it stay there for five minutes and then you drink it 13 minutes before you go out of the house. This will prevent vertigo or dizziness. If you have no fresh ginger root, you can opt for powdered form of ginger. Use one teaspoon in one cup of water. Just be mindful of the brand that you're using. Opt for the ones with no sugar or less sugar content. Ginger is a natural remedy that works every time against vertigo and nausea without any undesirable side effects. But it would still be best to consult with your doctor to get to the root cause of what's causing your vertigo or nausea. I hope that you have found this video helpful. If you have learned something out of this video, I would really appreciate it if you can take only one second of your time to please click the like button below as your way of supporting this channel. Please share this video to your friends and family members as well. This is a natural remedy that can work wonders. If you have reached the end of this video, please comment, focus in the comment section below. I would really love to hear from you. Thank you very much for watching. This is again Doc Sherry. Stay safe, stay happy and healthy. God bless you.